The NBA is set to announce the next two expansion teams. I'm Logan Summit, formerly of ESPN, now with Salt Media TV. The NBA is not ready to announce quite yet, but sources behind the scenes say they have 100% picked Seattle and Viva Las Vegas to be the next two cities to host NBA teams. Both teams will be situated in the Western League, whereas Memphis or New Orleans will be moving east. And Mexico City is also up for consideration, but nothing can be confirmed at this time. Make sure you go over to saltmediatv.com because now you know, and knowing's half the battle. Bet big or go home. I'm Logan Radio Rocks, it's day three here at COD, and I'm going to tell you how to make money. If you've been following me for the past three days, guess what? You're welcome, because you can take those bets all the way to the bag. I'm here for Salt Media TV. Let's talk about today. FaZe Clan, unbettable at minus 1,000, but you are going to take... Toronto at minus 135 to beat New York. That's my bet. You, you can take that to the bank. And now you know, and knowing's half the battle. So recently you've been hanging out a lot with Joe Rogan. What's that like? He's great, great guy, much taller than you might think, and, and very built, very built guy. Now, why is Joe Rogan running the UFC? Whatever happened to Dana White? Where is he? I actually think that they fused into one person. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was, I was, yeah, I think. Logan Paul will return to the boxing ring on October 14th to face jujitsu specialist Dylan Danitz in a boxing match. I'm Logan Summit for Salt Media TV. We're going to break it down. The fight will be the co-main event of the Happy Punch Prime card, co-headlined by KSI and Tommy Fury. Logan Paul is currently winless 0-2-1 across three boxing matches, having lost two of those bad boys to KSI himself. And, of course, the exhibition in the the weakest possible terms against Floyd Mayweather. Flip that coin and Dylan Danis is a jiu-jitsu fighter whose claim to fame is as a training partner and coach of Conor McGregor. Although he has never fought in a professional boxing match. And yes, kids, this is considered a professional fight. As if the White House couldn't get any whiter, a little bag of bad has been found. And Bet Online AG has your Vegas odds to find out who's been making it snow in July. I'm Logan Summit, formerly of ESPN. Now throw it down your betting lines via Salt Media TV. The odds on favorite to have misplaced Escobar's little friend is everyone's polarizing first son, Hunter Biden at plus 200 at plus a thousand we may have to look at one of your jonas brothers hey joe what about the other pop divas olivia rodrigo and elton john are both showing plus 2000 you can however count out some of these long shot bets as wow. snoop doggy dog is plus 1600 and we all know he is a strictly smoked diet i am a little disappointed martha didn't make the list and cross off tom Woo! brady he's too busy dating kim k to care but my sleeper pick is ex pop diva turned Hulu super sleuth Selena Gomez and my overall pick to win is Matthew McConaughey Matty loves a good time and have you ever heard him tell a story he's fighting for supremacy in his own head make sure to visit SoulMediaTV.com for all the latest info because now you know and knowing's half the battle bet bigger go home